Crypto is for fucking dorks. I think a really smart man said that once. And I thought, now that I've gone viral within the crypto community, it'd be a perfect time for me to not change my mind at all because I meant everything I fucking said. You're all losers. I said it once, said it twice, and I fucking meant it. All losers. In fact, I didn't realize what losers crypto Twitter truly were until this recent adventure into the cesspit of the blockchain. Unbelievable. People are actually buying crypto based on Andrew Tate's Twitter posts. The man has been very open over the years about being a scammer and a criminal. Yet, so many are willing to throw their money down the toilet over this absolute degenerate. And now, in typical Andrew Tate style, he's putting an even bigger target on his back for the authorities. I just so happened to stumble across an obscure video on YouTube that was a leak of Andrew and Tristan Tate's Unfair Advantage series. Unfair Advantage is their stream that is only available inside Hustlers University, or as it's now known, the real world. And these absolute idiots have not learned a thing from the pimping hose degree. They don't understand that just because they say something behind a paywall, it doesn't mean that someone won't leak it. Like when Andrew moronically put himself on camera, explaining how he traffics women and defrauds them out of taxes. Tax is also another important element for controlling your woman. You're not going to pay anybody tax because you're getting paid in Bitcoin. But you need to tell your girl that you're paying the tax. Because girls are lazy, and girls are stupid, and girls don't understand how taxes work. She'll sit there and go, okay, okay, now that allows you... I do have to warn that whoever uploaded this video put some annoying text over the top of the whole thing. Thanks a lot, hate real world. To start getting his so-called students excited for his announcement, Andrew immediately got a bit silly. Now, I don't know if you guys understand this, or if you guys realize this, but since yesterday, when I conquered the entire crypto market, billionaires are begging to do business with me. It's not just a matter of Andrew Tate has a new project. Your favorite crypto exchange, billionaire whales, you name it, are begging me to work with them. The most credible people in this space, people who own entire chains, people who own mining facilities in, in America and in China, everywhere, be billionaires. The partners who are coming to me are immense. <laughs> And here's where we're going to move on to the plan, which everybody is so interested in hearing, and the plan of how I intend to enrich all of you as much as possible without upsetting God, mm -hmm. and hopefully without going to jail. Oh boy, strap yourselves in. Are you ready to hear Andrew's amazing plan? However, I want you all to understand something. And to make you understand it, we're going to discuss a hypothetical an imaginary world. And in this imaginary world, we're gonna to put together this project. He thinks he's so clever at the start of this video by saying this is an imaginary hypothetical plan. As this rant progresses, you will see he completely forgets about this. Imagine I were to put together, this is an imaginary project, people. Something like this. Let's imagine I were to partner with billionaires for instant liquidity. Let's imagine staking happened very shortly after launch so that you could make money forever. So it's an investment. Let's imagine I airdropped it to the students of the real world because why would I not make my students richer than everybody else? Imagine there was an airdrop to the real world students. Of course, you'll get exclusive access if you pay Andrew $50 a month to join his alleged pyramid scheme. And then imagine it was correlated with my release from the Romanian borders and I started flying around the world to promote it. Sitting with your favorite movie stars. Please remember guys, I'm more famous than anyone. All the movie stars, all the famous people, 
the red carpet, all that crap I've avoided, I'll start going to. I'll fill up stadiums. I'll do speaking tours. I'll do a tour on a bus around the country. All these other companies will be begging me to get involved. Once again, putting in millions of dollars to this project to pump this coin. And, this and there it is. We are well and truly off the rails. Andrew is telling his so-called students that he will be free from Romania to travel and promote this coin in a world tour in the near future. He will be walking the red carpet, meeting all these kids' favourite celebrities, and selling out stadiums. This promise is fraudulent and literally impossible. In April, the judge in Romania ordered that Andrew and Tristan, as well as their accomplices Luana and Georgiana, are to go to trial. The Taves have appealed this decision. Once that appeal is heard, we will most likely get a trial date. In March, the judge ordered Andrew and Tristan to be extradited to the UK to face more charges of human trafficking and rape. This is locked in to happen as soon as the legal proceedings are finished in Romania. So even in the unlikely hypothetical situation that a Romanian judge declares tomorrow that Andrew and Tristan are now free, they will immediately be arrested, thrown in a plane to face another set of charges back in England. Andrew's red carpet stadium tour is an embarrassing, humiliating lie. And the students of the real world would see a huge increase in the airdrop token value as it went to retail and everybody who was not a student began to buy. Now, if this imaginary project were to take place, it would be very important that I distributed tokens fairly while also giving you the easiest money play in history. Because the easiest money play in history is to join the real world for $49, get your tokens and wait for them to go up. See guys, this is awesome. Andrew is only gonna scam everyone outside of the real world. And for everyone inside the real world, this is gonna be the easiest money play in history. Come on boys, wake up. So what I think we should do is we should link the amount of tokens you get in an airdrop to your status within the real world. Members of the council will get the most. You can join the council via the courses tab. Then of course, we will have kings, rooks, bishops, knights. You will all get a base allocation. This means that if you're a knight, you should work as hard as possible to become a bishop, to work as hard as possible to become a rook, to work as hard as possible to become a king, because you know the day this imaginary project comes true, you will be rewarded for all of that hard work in cold, hard cash. Next, your power level should also give you a separate airdrop. You should have an airdrop based on your rank and an airdrop based on your power level. I have told what you just heard was a big, fat upsell. He's saying the higher ranking you have in the real world, the more coins you will have access to for this super duper project. Andrew Tate's courses are known for trying to squeeze every penny out of you with extra courses and upsells. Even in the war room, which costs $8,000 to join. As soon as you get in, you are immediately inundated with prompts to buy extra courses and level up. And then I'm told, before you get started, you should buy these five courses. Again, I'm all for courses. Courses are beneficial if you seeked the course, you wanted the course, not somebody telling you, you need these courses. And if I don't do these courses, I'm not going to be respected as a member. I'm not going to be prioritised as a member. It's kind of like, if you don't do them, if you don't do the courses, you kind of view that. Oh, you ain't even done this course, you ain't even done that course, so your opinion don't matter, that type of thing. Of course, once this project went live, everyone inside of the real world, 200,000 people are gonna be trying to pump it. Imagine that, along with all the advertising I'd be doing on a worldwide tour. I really truly believe it would be the biggest crypto project in history. I would have an open source contract and my wallet would be clean and easy for everybody to see that I am forever diamond hands. I will never sell. 
the biggest crypto project in history. I like saying to you guys that if you don't work, you will not get many tokens in the airdrop and you will miss your chance for millions of dollars. I like to say that because then if you're too lazy to log into the real world every day, you deserve it. It's only fair that I warn you in advance. Plus, I am not going to be free to leave Romania for three, four months. What a brain dead lying idiot. And it would all tie together pretty well if I gave you guys a few months. I've given you some tidbits. We have Roost uh, that I'm invested in, Real Nigger Tate, Top G. But the rest of the time, besides playing with those coins, you should be focused on increasing your rank and increasing your power level and logging into the real world every day and getting as many coins as possible, joining the council so you have up-to-date information and get the largest possible. That, when I am free and when the project does launch, you are monumentally rewarded. And you must wake up every day and train hard and log in and try and give value and increase your power level and do anything it takes to become as powerful as possible inside of the real world before the airdrop comes true. That is the only way that you are going to be saved via this project. That is salvation. And on the way, you will learn the lessons required for you to enjoy the money once you have it. That is what God wants from me. And that is what God wants from you. This is this crypto scam that may or may not happen is your only chance at salvation and is what God wants for you. This is totally not a cult. Self. If you knew the names of the people who were involved in this project and blowing up my phone trying to make it come true, I, s I don't think you'd sleep for months. This is as big as things can possibly be. And it's going to be executed flawlessly. This is also very important for you people who think you can join for a month and quit the real world and just go back to being a nobody. No, 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 no. You have to stay inside to increase your rank, to get your power level. Because if you quit and then you rejoin, you lose all your power points. So why would you lose all your power points to save $49? It doesn't even make sense. And guys, I don't need you as students. Quit if you want. That's what I was about to say. Fucking quit then. Bye. I don't give a shit. I will love the look on the face of you quitters who left the real world and didn't dedicate yourselves the day this project comes true. It's like... And to finish off a bit of typical Tate high pressure tactics to try and manipulate the desperate, insecure, child members of his stupid program, most of which are living in poverty, to convince them they mustn't leave because this time he's going to make them rich. The internet truly has made the world stupid. How did anyone invest any money based on this man's words? Over the years, Andrew Tate has been very open about the fact that he's a degenerate criminal who sold drugs, trafficked women, and scammed men at any opportunity he could get. The fact that anyone would listen to this clown about anything, including investments, let alone pay him a monthly fee to escape the matrix, just shows that you have no respect for yourself whatsoever. There is an epidemic of desperate, insecure young men, and Andrew Tate is in absolutely no way part of the solution.